Hello everyone, it's me Chebby from Unique Tutorials. Today, in this video, I will show you how to connect and wirelessly control Canon DSLR or mirrorless camera using Android and iOS smartphone. So, without further more delay, let's begin. So, right now, you can see my Canon mirrorless camera. So, if you're having a Canon DSLR camera, still the tricks will remain the same. So, for these tricks, I'm gonna use an Android smartphone. So, if you're using a iOS smartphone like iPhone still the tricks will remain the same. So firstly on your smartphone if you're using a Android smartphone then just go to the Play Store and if you're using a iOS smartphone like iPhone go to the App Store. So in the Play Store just search for one application name as Canon Camera Connect just search this application and the first you will see the application just click on install to install this application once the installation is done just tap on open on opening it will ask you some permissions just click on agree click on agree again you can read the instructions or you can just click on skip click on let's get started now you can see here it's asking to register your camera right just tap on it and select your respective Canon DSLR or mirrorless camera so in my case I'm using a Canon M50 Mark II so here it is so if you don't find then you can just use the search box to search the respective Canon DSLR or mirrorless model number so now you can see I need to enable the Bluetooth as well as the Wi-Fi just enable the Wi-Fi as well as the Bluetooth so now before proceeding further just turn on your Canon mirrorless or DSLR camera and now just click on this menu and now just go to wireless settings click on OK now just enable the Wi-Fi as well as the Bluetooth just enable the Bluetooth too. And now just select this Wi Fi or Bluetooth connection. And here just select this connect to smartphone. Now just select this add a device to connect to. Now here you will get Android or iOS. So just select this do not display. Just select the first option. Now it's asking pair via Bluetooth or connect via Wi Fi. So we're gonna use firstly with Bluetooth. Just select the pair with via Bluetooth. Click on OK. Now on your respective smartphone, just tap on this Bluetooth. Just click on next. Click on allow. Now you can see here it automatically detects my Canon mirrorless camera. So you can see here, just tap on it. Now it will show you Bluetooth pairing request. Just click on pair as well as you need to select the same option on your camera Wait for a few seconds. So finally you can see paired with. So just click on allow on your respective smartphone. Click on OK. Now you can see. Now you can import images from your Canon DSLR or mirrorless camera and if you want to wireless the control then you can just click on the shoot. Now it's searching for the your Canon mirrorless or DSLR camera. Wait for a few seconds. Click on connect. So connect it. Now you can see here. So you can see. Now I can use my smartphone to capture photo wirelessly. So let me take a photo from my smartphone. So you can see I can use my smartphone to capture photo. And if you want to import the photos from your Canon mirrorless or DSLR camera, then just click on this import images. Then it will show you all the captured images or the images being stored on your Canon DSLR or mirrorless camera 
So select the respective image and you can see here option import just click on import now you can select the options if you want to compress since the image files may be quite big in size depending on what type of image format you are capturing so just click on ok now it's being imported so click on open photo app so finally you can see here we have imported the images from our Canon mirrorless or DSLR camera to our respective smartphone. So by using this application named as Canon Camera Connect, you can connect and wirelessly control Canon DSLR or mirrorless camera using Android and iOS smartphone very easily. So if you never known about the school tricks, then you should definitely give it a try. So if you find this video tutorial useful, please click on the thumbs like button and if you're new to our channel, click on the subscribe button. And lastly, thanks for watching.